10 years ago, I don't know anybody that discussed SUDEP in a patient interaction. Um, and that's true across, across countries because in a paternalistic way, uh, we didn't want to, we didn't either want to worry someone with the possibility of SUDEP or didn't know the risk. It's been a decade and things have dramatically changed. We do know risk factors and we do know that the research says that patients and caregivers of people with epilepsy want disclosure at the time of the visit or immediately thereafter, and they want to know it independent of risk. And so that, is, uh, that leads to the second issue of when do you discuss it and how. Uh, we now think it's really you know, mandatory, with few exceptions based on patient need, uh, that, that if a uh, child or an adult has ongoing tonic-clonic seizures, um, it needs to be brought to the attention of the patient and caregiver that they are at the highest risk for SUDEP. Uh, there's some data that suggests that nocturnal supervision can, can influence the risk and prevent death, but they need to know about it, so disclosure is mandatory, not only for nocturnal supervision, but to but to be aggressive about their own care in terms of pursuing additional medications or surgery or VNS or ketogenic diet. Um, another part of this, however, is patients and families want to know about SUDEP even if they're at low risk. And so what that does is it puts the, the responsibility on the physician to have that conversation uh, with everyone. Even if it's just to say, you might hear about this from the popular press or on the internet or in patient um, uh, support groups, but we want you to know that your risk is low because you or your child uh, are not having seizures. So whatever you're doing, keep it up. And so we've evolved uh, very, very quickly in terms of physician practice from not discussing it all to discussing it with those folks that are at greatest risk to discussing it with everyone. Because if we are patient and caregiver oriented, uh, it's very clear that that's what they want to know.